Hey, uh, good morning, guys. My name is Narendra. I'm a cybersecurity instructor for uh, Cyber Talents. Uh, so today we are gonna see a uh, different uh, uh, the cybersecurity opportunities uh, for freshers and uh, also for uh, the experienced uh, professionals as well. The first job posting, what you are seeing on the screen, is for the freshers. Uh, this 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 particular role uh, they are looking for the uh, uh, the freshers uh, who passed out uh, recently at 2022 or 21 2020 uh, so you can um, uh, you know uh, by looking at the job description so i can understand uh, they are looking for a, a associate engineer or a, it's like a l1 uh, job uh, duties where uh, uh, they're looking for a candidate who been trained into a security operations or uh, the CH. So mostly the interview questions will be uh, will uh, will be uh, you know the fundamentals of network and uh, you know like OSI layers, how how the OSI layers works, how the internet communication works, and uh, from the uh, you know the TCP UDP. Uh, TCP handshake, um, and then they'll ask, uh, you know, the different protocols and their port numbers, and then they'll ask. Uh, mostly, they'll ask, uh, you know, uh, the DNS, how DNS works, DHCP, and uh, different security, uh, network security devices, which uh, uh, which the organization use, like a uh, firewalls, endpoint security. Uh, IPS, IDS, the proxy, uh, you know, you have a very uh, fair understanding. I mean, uh, the fundamental understanding of uh, uh, these tools will will really helpful for you to clear the interview. Also on the security side, um, like uh, uh, confidentiality uh, what we call a CIA triad, confidentiality, integrity and availability. So you you have to uh, 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 understand or you have a knowledge on the encryptions. So what is encryption? What is a decryption? And the different types of encryption methods like a symmetric encryption, asymmetric encryption, and also you have the uh, knowledge on uh, you know the SSL handshake, uh, like what we have uh, the TCP handshake, like SSL and handshake knowledge and um, so you have the understanding of uh, you know the malware so different types of malware you have knowledge uh, like virus form trojans and the differences between these things and also the uh, the latest uh, the attacks you have a knowledge and the cyber kill chain the mitre framework and uh, sim tool like any of sim tool you can pick it up and like if you say splunk so you have uh, knowledge on the uh, architecture the components uh, uh, how the architecture works so you have a you have to be a very clear and uh, when you are uh, uh, you know uh, uh, when you are giving an interview make sure you have knowledge on this uh, areas so that's how you can easily clear so by looking, uh, you know, so you you will be gonna handle the P1 and P2. Uh, uh, mostly, it will not be a P1 and P2 uh, instance. So where you gonna handle the uh, the low priority uh, instance, like uh, uh, like for example, if there is a firewall uh, being alerted saying that there's an inbound communication from one of a source IP, so where one of IP, so you have to investigate the source IP. What is the reputation of the source IP? The same way for endpoint security, if any malware has been identified, uh, you know what is this? What is that file? You will be using your open source threat intel to find out what is that file it is. Okay, and uh, and then the incident response. Uh, so again, they've been asking for an incident response also. Okay, um, and uh, 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 mostly elements. Uh, may not be involved into uh, incident response cases they'll be uh, doing a uh, uh, element triaging okay like uh, alerts monitoring of uh, security alerts and then investigation investigations like as i said the one example and you have knowledge on uh, uh, incident response uh, phases like uh, different phases are there you have to you have a knowledge on that maybe there is a questions on that 
so um, yeah so that's uh, uh you know that areas if you focus yes definitely you can uh, clear and you can share the uh, uh, you know uh, the job dis- uh, the, your resume to this particular uh, um, hamid pasha uh, nil consulting so the so that you will be uh, uh, you will get a more details and uh, the next one is uh, the SOC analyst, uh, this, this particular role is for the uh, uh, Dubai, it is an international opportunity. So I have not uh, have much information about this particular uh, role. Uh, they just given the, the skill set. And um, yeah. so we have uh, uh, like Arcsight, logarithm, device integrations. This is more of the uh, SIM administration side uh, who have a fair understanding or who have a great knowledge or a good knowledge on uh, uh, the administration side, you can drop an email um, so that uh, you will get a more uh, details from the the recruiters. Okay, and um, the next job is for the PTM. So the PTM, uh, this is for the L1 and L2 roles they are looking for. So I'm not uh, having any uh, job description, but I'll share the link. Even the even in uh, the link also, they are just asking like. Uh, 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 just uh, you know the details they are asking so I, I, I am gonna share the link for this particular uh, job you can uh, go and see um, I know they're just asking to upload your resume followed by your uh, uh, details your personal details your email ID phone number all these things so that you just go and uh, you know uh, share your details along with your resume so that you may have a callback and you will have more information about it and uh, next one is um, this is for the again freshers but this is not for the security operations guys uh, this is for uh, the offensive uh, offensive guys like offensive team offensive uh, like like we have the defensive security offensive security so offensive security is something it deals with the penetration testing uh, vulnerability assessment um, and which which more of a red teaming activities who have uh, I mean who have trained on the red teaming activities uh, especially uh, uh, CH uh, um, so the penetration testing and the OACP so they're looking for especially they're looking for uh, OACP certified but uh, with the freshers uh, 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 OACP certified is it's very difficult to uh, get the people in the from the market so mostly if you are trained on the oacp uh, that will be a you know with a great uh, you know mostly you'll be have the preference uh, or even the penetration testing also if you are uh, well and good so the knowledge will definitely helpful but uh, it's, it's not mandatory that the certification but you drop an email to them uh, it, it's for the auges networks and uh, so you drop an email to them and uh, possibly you'll get back if you are trained or if you have the good knowledge on the red teaming activities you drop an email so that probably you'll get back a, a call from them okay um so you have that email here you can drop an email to them and the next one is for uh, so a level two uh, sim analyst and shock analyst so this is again uh, the same uh, you see a uh, network monitoring this is for a uh, firewall alerts ips alerts you'll be getting mostly uh, proxy alerts uh, pro, uh, you'll be getting a dlp alerts and uh, vulnerability research and patching which uh, which most of uh, the times it is uh, the quali scan nurses scans uh, uh, which is more of a uh, vulnerability assessment team where they'll be doing these activities and you must have the they are asking the knowledge on this as well and yeah it's fine if you have at least uh, uh, knowledge on uh, threat detection, incident response, log investigation. These three comes under SOC, threat detection and forensic investigation, IR, log analysis, log investigation, network monitor. These four comes under the SOC, even threat uh, vulnerability research and uh, um, patching also will be uh, 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 performed by some of the SOC analysts, but some of the companies, uh, uh, you know, there is a separate teams. Yeah, so the rest of all uh, the key skills mentioned here will be suitable. Um, so this sort of question, this sort of uh, job, uh, uh, L2 role where you must have, anyway, the fundamental uh, security concept, you must have the knowledge like 
the port numbers, protocols, Windows, uh, security, event IDs, malware, all these things. The other than you must have some scenario based questions you may have to face like so what type of recent uh, 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 critical alert you've been faced uh, and you have to tell that, uh, uh, you know, uh, briefly uh, how, for example, if there is attack is happened on your organization, how you've been worked on it and how been you've been uh, mitigated that. Uh, so what is the response plan uh, you, you followed? So all these things you have to uh, tell to the uh, interviewer along with that, uh, 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 you have to know the recent attacks, uh, especially uh, the major, uh, uh, you know, the major uh, issues like a major uh, uh, impact. So you have to talk about. Uh, you you have a knowledge. If somebody asks, so you you must have the knowledge of the major uh, attack which happens recently, and also the APTs. Uh, you must have the knowledge on the MITRE framework. Uh, the different phases start from reconnaissance initial access to until ex exfiltration and impact. So you must have the knowledge of all the phases, um, uh, and you you have to know what is a TTP, what is an importance of TTP, uh, threat hunting, what is a threat hunting, what how it helps uh, to the organization, and you also have a knowledge on uh, threat intelligence. Uh, malware analysis fundamentals of malware analysis like static and dynamic uh, so how static uh, analysis will be performed uh, dynamic analysis will be performed because if the role if your experience level is going above and uh, above and I mean at least four plus you are going so definitely this sort of questions will be there so you have uh, uh, ready for uh, these technologies you must have the knowledge so that you will be able to crack the interviews uh, easily. So I uh, request you to share your CVs to this particular uh, email called uh, Sheetal uh, uh Okay, then you can get more information. And this is for the Wonderland Day, and I'm, I'm I've shared the link there uh, in the in the description of this particular video. You can go and apply. This is also. Again, uh, uh, the same L2 responsibilities, what I've discussed so far, like uh, malware analysis, threat intelligence, threat hunting, uh, the fundamentals of security and the real-time scenarios, I mean, uh, real-time issues we, we, you've been handled and uh, phishing attacks, you can talk about uh, what, uh, different phishing attacks you've been handled. Uh, uh, what is the response plan? What, how you responded? How you mitigated that phishing attack? Uh, what is impact it was created and the, how you perform the header analysis all these things you you must have the knowledge and you must be able to tell to the uh, uh, interviewer especially uh, the header analysis is also very important uh, you know the different uh, sections are there in the headers uh, start from a written path received by so you just go through it um, so soon i am planning for uh, uh, freshers interview questions followed by uh, uh, the experienced up to five to six or uh, seven years experience which is l2 l3 level uh, i'm gonna uh, create uh, uh, videos for interview questions as well so i request you to uh, subscribe uh, for regular updates and uh, so it's always because we are sharing our uh, uh, updates job updates on daily basis if you subscribe immediately you'll get a pop-up and then you can apply it otherwise uh, so the jobs are mostly uh, you know if they're posting based mostly if, if you apply within a seven days five to seven days then you will you will be uh, considered if not somebody will send and they will be uh, you know take that uh, opportunity so so please proactively uh, uh, i mean please uh, proactively uh, apply for that so that uh, you will be uh, you will get the right opportunity and you will be play you will your cv will be considered and uh, your interview process will start if you are late i mean if you are not subscribed so then you will get you will not notified so that uh, you know you may not uh, you may lose the some of the opportunities so this is also a good company uh, uh, you know so that uh, you apply and this is for the pune location I've shared the job description. Uh, I mean, uh, the link I'm, I'm, I've shared, uh, which which contains all the job description, and this is similar to the L2 role what we have discussed so far. Okay, please apply for it, and uh, and take.
next slide is for the this is for the usd global uh, the link also shared uh, in the job description you can go through it and this is also l2 role and what we have discussed but this is a kind of risk assessment uh, who have a knowledge on risk assessment um, uh, especially your uh, like the compliance side uh regulatory regulatory compliance like gdpr nist uh yes was uh, uh, so this sort of people can apply this okay the job description was posted there uh, i mean a job link uh, you can uh, verify the job description and then if you are suitable you can apply that role as well and uh, the next one is tata steel so this is also a kind of a mixed of uh, cyber uh, operations mm -hmm. like uh, uh, SOC operations followed by your uh, risk assessment uh, and uh, the compliances. Uh, you can verify this also in your uh, in the link, uh, and then if you are suitable, you can apply for that as well. And um, the finally, our um, so please regularly follow us for on uh, LinkedIn and uh, Instagram and uh, our YouTube channels where we will be sharing our LinkedIn and sorry for uh, link also. So, so it's always better uh, sharing our sharing our friends they all get a part of it or uh, I had also you get now for subscribers so that you will be proactive you will be getting a lot of people who will be getting that we will not find you in the so this all I will get from you for our if you if it is fail if it is fail or success whatever the whatever it is uh, we can comment here thank you thank you so much <laughs>